कार्तिके शर्मा कमॉन एक तो रह गया सर नहीं रखिए कुछ रिजर्व में रखिए ईज ऑफ बिजनेस में क्या है परेशान है लोग जीएसटी वालों से और इसके अलावा आप इधर से बोल रहे हो कुछ रिजर्व में रखिए रेड टेपिज्म से तो इस पर सर हमें कोशिश करनी चाहिए ईज ऑफ बिजनेस हमें बढ़ाना चाहिए और कार्तिके जी थ्री मिनट्स सर फ्रॉम इनहेरिटिंग एन इंडियन इकोनॉमी विच वॉज स्लिपिंग साउथ वर्ड्स टू बींग painted as the global bright spot with the indian economy registering the fastest growth rate among large economies for two successive successful fiscals and in the course for the third time in financial year 24 is a stellar achievement of the modi government that invites deep analysis the journey of indian economy was steered clear through the phases of global slowdown in 2019 covid lockdowns commodity price steep escalation due to the war in ukraine and global tensions and tightening of global financial conditions india's economy has been the fastest growing among the world's 20 largest economies for the seven of the past 9 years and those were only the seven years in the past 76 years that india has achieved this distinction india's usd 3.3 trillion gdp overtook that of the uk in the fiscal year ending march 31 2022 making it the fifth largest economy in the world The Indian economy, according to the IMF, estimates will emerge as the world's third largest economy by 2027. Hoping, hopping over Japan and Germany as its GDP crosses US five trillion dollars by 2047, India aspires to be a developed economy. Under the visionary leadership of the Honorable Prime Minister Modi, sir, I would like to quote a couplet from the famous poet Vasim Barelvi: "Darya ka sara nasha." उतरता चला गया दरिया का सारा नशा उतरता चला गया वो डुबाते रहे मुझे और मैं उभरता चला गया दुनिया समझ में आई मगर आई देर से कच्चा बहुत था रंग उतरता चला गया सर वी हैव अचीव सक्सेस इन इम्प्रूविंग आर जी डी पी फ्रॉम टू पॉइंट थ्री ट्रिलियन इन टू थाउजेंड फोर्टीन टू थ्री पॉइंट सेवन फाइव ट्रिलियन नाउ ऑन द ग्राउंड इन थर्टीन फोर्टीन आप पर कैपिटल इनकम वॉज सिक्सटी एट which has now increased to 1 lakh 80000 rupees in 2223 in 2014 the capital expenditure was 3.9 lakh crores and the union government under the leadership of prime minister has increased it to rupees 10 lakh crores by 2023 a senior member of parliament before me spoke about the issue of states the union government has increased the allocation to the states under the various schemes from rupees 30 lakh crores during 2004 to 14 to about 100 lakh crores in the 9 years from 14 to 23 between 2004 and 14 tax collections was 19 lakh crores which has now increased to 70 lakh crores in the 9 years from 14 to 23 gst collection has reached rupees 1.87 lakh crores in april 2023 and monthly average gst collection is 1.69 lakh crores our foreign exchange reserves was 309 billion today they stand at 593 billion so sectors like hydrogen semiconductor electric vehicles solar energy defense sharma ji drone please space mining please conclude sharma ji please thank you sir